the test tubes of death are not on back here either. But you know what would be sweet? If you put a baby in there. <laughs> All right, guys, we are still on the road. We are in Madison, Wisconsin. I think this is called East Town Mall. I'm not sure, but there is the Spirit Halloween. And I believe by the looks of it, this used to be an Elder Beerman. It's right between this JCPenney and this Dick's Sporting Goods right here. And let me tell you, I would love to go inside this whole mall and look around because it is deader than anything we're gonna see inside there. Yep, by the shape of this, and where you can see sort of an E and a B. I'm pretty sure it was an Elder Beerman. Who cares? Let's go inside and see what the Spirit Halloween has. Who in the world is JBA? And how cool is this entrance, guys? Look how they have the giant Halloween sign over the double doors. All right, let's go on in. I see Lord Raven front and center in the Monster Laboratory. I'm kind of disappointed that we don't see the possessed pumpkin here, but we have seen him in a couple of other stores that we've been in recently. Let's go ahead and give Lord Raven his due. Hello, Mr. Nostrils. Uh-oh, he got mad at me. Even in the stores where he's turned up loud, he's still hard to hear. And I think it's probably because the speaker is like in his back pointing that way. Luckily, you can actually attach another speaker to him. So if you had him and he wasn't loud enough, you could put your own speaker on there. All right, let's go ahead in and see what else the laboratory has to offer. First, just for the heck of it, let's look to see if they have those shirts that we've been looking for. I did see them in one other store and you probably have seen that video by now, but they do not have them here unless they're hanging up somewhere. All right, back over to the laboratory slash castle. It sort of looks like a castle. Let's check out Mr. Grimm here. How many times have we heard Grimm talking this year? Busy burying something in the backyard. Okay, mister, we're gonna pass you and go on over here to the bog zombie. Let's get this guy going. Yeah, he's super loud. <laughs> I love how loud he is in here. Chains of death. All right, let's go ahead through the laboratory and see what's happening in there. All right, we don't have Crouchy, but we do have Barry. Let's see if we can get him going. Here he goes. He's not doing too shabby. He's swinging in his cage, trying to get out. He's not banging his head as he is in a lot of other stores. Three of the bubble tubes of death are working. This one's not working at all, which I swear a second ago when I walked in here it was, so I'm gonna have to look back through at that video. But I did notice that there's just a big hole up here. There's nothing up there. Wait a minute, what do I hear out here? It's Shorty. Gotta love Shorty. And I said this in the other video, but I didn't even know that his boxing gloves actually come out. Look at this, he's still moving. He's just not making any sound. <laughs> All right, Shorty, take a chill pill. Um, yeah, I didn't know you could actually remove those gloves. Kind of crazy. And look at this, speaking of Shorty, they have one on the floor for sale. Where in the world is Punchy though? I have not seen him in any stores except for the flagship store. He should be right here waiting for us. Actually, Shorty should be right here and Punchy should be right there. But he's not, so let's move on. Look at this, they have a Bubba for sale right here, 129. And it's funny because some stores they have this up and some they don't. So if you go to buy a Bubba, make sure you ask if you can get him for 129. Look Look at this over here, we have a sitting scarecrow, and over here we have a night crawler and a Lucky Bottoms. Isn't it peculiar how Lucky Bottoms is on the bottom? We have pose and stay glow skeletons. We have sinister spirit dolls. We have the Danny and Binks pop. 
we have the Killer Clowns Pop, we have the Bull Billy Butchers and Pop, I almost called him Bully, and the Sanderson Sisters 3-pack. Okay, let's go ahead and make our way back here. Oh, look, we have a ginormous stack of jumping spiders as usual. Brown, black, and red, and black. We have nozzles over here, and look at that hairdo. It still just amazes me how many different hairdos he has in these stores. His hair is crimped. All right, let's get him going here. Come on, Mr. Nazi. He does not have the fog on. Look at this, it's so funny because the way that he's put in there, he can just like barely move. Let's do it one more time here. Look at that, he can just barely move in there. Too funny. We'll go over to the other side in a second here, but look at this, the tunnel of electric death is going nuts in here. It's not even waiting for anybody just to walk through. The floor is so loud. Both of the monitors are working here. Look at this, we got young Crouchy getting ready to get us. And these are already electrifying our face. Come with me through the electrifying experience. Wait a minute, what in the heck? I don't know what's supposed to be up here, but it's just a big hole. All right, we don't have anybody else set up over here. We got a bunch of posters. We don't have the monitors up here yet, but we do have Lil Skelly Bones. Now, hold on. Let's let him crouch down again, and then we'll let him scare us. All right, here we go. Are you coming? Come on, Skelly. Okay, I hear him. Here he comes. There you go. You gotta love Skelly Bones. The test tubes of death are not on back here either, but you know what would be sweet? If you put a baby in there. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, somebody's gonna kill me for saying that. Speaking of babies, look at what we have here. We do not have a burrito baby, guys. At least over here. There might be one somewhere else in the store, but we no do not have a burrito baby amongst the ones waiting to be adopted. But we do have this creepy baby doll over here. I love this thing, it's so weird. Look at the eyes on that thing. Aw, oh, I called it a thing. I'm sorry, Mr. Baby. <laughs> Dang, I think you need some serious gold bond on those feet. Aside from the creepy baby doll, we have decrepit haunted doll, Ira the Eerie Emma doll, Rosalie. She actually reminds me of the Titanic, like a doll somebody would have lost on the Titanic. Maybe that's where she came from. Maybe she died on the sinking of the Titanic and then came back to life. And then down here we also have the pumpkin nester doll and a uh, hugs. Wait a minute, I see another baby head poking out over there. Let's go over here. Okay, that sounded totally wrong, hold on. Nobody's actually having babies in the spirit Halloween. But there is this one over here awaiting adoption right by her favorite pet, the killer cat. They have about the same inflatables as every other store has, it looks like. But I do see the creepy crimson girl on a swing. Usually all we see is the empty soul girl on a swing, but this one actually has a creepy crimson girl on a swing. Wait a minute, what is this bunny mask? Have I seen this anywhere else? L wire bad bunny mask. Um. Okay, you gotta pull that yellow thing in order to activate it. But it looks like the ears light up as well as the eyes and the whiskers. What the heck? Is that blood on his cheek? Oh well, all right, bad bunny. Oh look, they have the nighty night mask too. This is the one where the chin actually moves. So it looks like you're talking when you say, trick or treat. Look how big his mouth is. It's more like trick or tra. Still haven't seen any Halloween kills masks in here. Have you seen any Halloween Kills masks, Mr. Chicken? Look at this, I love how they have two different kinds of plush Oogie Boogies, but like, why is this one super green and this one is burlap? Have I missed something in the movie Nightmare Before Christmas where he's burlap at one point and then he turns green at another? Whoa, look at this. I don't think I've seen this in other stores either. Oogie Boogie jewelry tray. Look at this. That's pretty cool. You put your jewelry on there and like your rings on his hand. Wait a minute. What is this one? A zero jewelry tray. This one is even better. Look at this. 
You could put your rings on his nose and other things down in the little bowl there. Hello, Bouncy Gizmo. Okay, we saw the dog costumes the other day, but I didn't see these. Tricks for Treats pet t-shirt. I do tricks for treats. Okay, and then there's this one. Support your local familiar. I don't get that. I've seen the familiar thing a couple times, but somebody tell me what that means because I have no clue. Lots of Beetlejuice plush here, including the sandworm. We have Chucky greeters and Sam greeters. Oh look, we have Sam groundbreakers up here too. We have some Sam sitting dolls here, some Annabelles. We have a good guy's Chucky and we have two of these talking Chucky dolls. I can't even pick him up. There he is. <laughs> You can see him moving in there, but you can't hear him because he's inside a box. Cut yourself out, sir! They have all these wall pictures here, and I think I've seen just about all of them, except for these right here. This one's Michael Myers, and then this one is Jason Voorhees from Friday the 13th. We got Pennywise here, and look at this one, Freddy Krueger. There's a reflection on there, so it's kind of hard to tell because it's a dark picture. Pretty cool. And they have some awesome Hocus Pocus stuff this year since the new movie is coming out. Of course, I love that every store has Billy Butcherson's head. They got the Billy Butcherson costume. Look at this, Sarah Sanderson, I like that outfit. Mary Sanderson. Then we have Winnie Sanderson. Look at that girl's face. <laughs> We have Sarah's cape here, and what's this down here? Oh, that's another Mary. Okay, we also have Winnie's cape here, and we also have Mary's cape. So you got all three capes for the ladies. There's wigs for all three of them. Well, there's two of them right there, hmm. And we even have a Binks one-piece costume this year. What have you done with my Thackeray? Away, beast. Oh, holy crap, guys, look at this. I've only seen this in one other store. This is awesome. It's the Beetlejuice snake. Apparently he's five feet long when you stretch the whole thing out. Wait a minute, look at this. He's got the rattler tail. It doesn't rattle though, what the heck? Let's see, he is $49.99. He is pretty cool if you're a big Beetlejuice fan. I don't remember if we came over here and looked for Monty yet, but obviously he's not here. Here's the scream stuff. We're still waiting for the other masks to come in. I'm not saying these aren't cool, but when I get this style, I want to order an original one. And uh, this one right here, it's a light up. I don't know. I mean, it's cool, but I just don't really want that one. There must just be issues with, I don't know, licensing or something, because all this stuff, Freddy and Chucky and Michael Myers and Jason, that stuff is all stocked. And then when you get around to Ghostface, they're just, for some reason, taking forever for the stuff to come in. I don't remember if I forgot to put stickers out yet or not, but let's go ahead and leave some. Let's come on over here and leave some for some little Skelly. There you go, buddy. And let's leave a couple in the tunnel of death here. All right, guys, I guess that's it for the Spirit Halloween here in Madison, Wisconsin. They had a lot of stuff in there. Kind of looking for a couple of specific things before I buy something else. So stick around and you'll find out what those are.